Ah, oh, please, dude. Place is scurry. Scurry. Oh, there's an item over there. I have to go back there. Maybe not this second, but at some point. Shit. Starting to think I probably should have set up that waypoint. Yep. That would have been a smart thing to do. Thorned Crimson Rectal Sword. What it says, right? Okay. Oh, God! This is fine. This is fine. It's fine. I'm fine. You're fine. I should have gotten the item. That would have been smart. I, don't, I think I fell too far for the item. I might have fallen too Let me in? No. Didn't work, chat. Oh god, I can't attack. Oh wait. We're doing it. I can't I can't just leave that item there, chat. This is a hundred percent run. I can't I can't just leave it. I don't feel right. I don't feel right. There's the big man. Her damn house. Oh God. Oh. Okay. Oh God. Uh... Rose's worst enemy is everywhere? Yes. My worst enemy is everything. Mostly gravity. But also everything. Yeah. <laughs> 
Boom! Okay. Map of Pilgrim's Perch Descent. So, interestingly enough, we've kind of passed the place. Yeah, the belled rise. We, we still need to find this, man. I don't think we found that. We have to go through a, a door with a bell. We haven't figured out how to open those doors with the bell. Hmm. Hi. Another lambera. Oh, is this it here? Uh, is this the door? So it goes. Maybe. Should you end up one of the few to earn a vestige, I'll tend to it. As I do. For whatever it's worth. And until I'm in the ground myself. The hallowed sentinels and Rogar will both show you horror enough, but nothing like what that lamp brings into view. And remember, you look into the shadows. Might be the shadows look back. Mind yourself, Lambera. Whether you took up that light willingly or not, you're on a treacherous path. And forever is that never as long yes. as you think. Mind yourself, you're on a trudge. Hey, Pilgrim's Purge Key. Interesting. We've never been in here before. He's got a little Wow, dude. What is this life? So is this a time-based thing? I don't if I think if I hit him when he has this up, it does damage to us. Let's see if it fades. Maybe he has to throw it. Oh, dude. Ow. Okay. Wow. Um. this yet. Okay. That bro just gave us a butt ton of souls. Wait. Oh, interesting. He's got the... Is he attached to the moth thing? To that? He is. That's interesting. How does that work? Dude, this thing also... This is like a higher level version of the other one. All, whoa. All of these are taking so much more... Oh my god. All of these are taking so much more damage than normal. I think this is a much higher level area. Yeah, hold up. I don't know if we're supposed to be here yet, dude. Is that guy with the shield going to be back? Leave Moth Mommy alone. <laughs> Alright, so here's this. This is going to open up a kind of cool buff that we can do. Here we go. 
Now we can do this. Hell yeah, buddy. So I think we're probably going to come back here a little later, especially if this dude is back. Is he back? Oh, maybe not. Oh, he's definitely back. He's right. <laughs> Defeated an enemy with an umbral finisher, pure blade armor. Uh, yo? Oh, that is heavy boy armor. Um. Nice. Okay. Let's go down here first. Ow. All the enemies here are so much more difficult. Bro, what are you doing? Jeez. Come back here. Oh, there's like multiple archers. <laughs> uh huh. Um. Hmm. Okay. 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 We're gonna come back here a little bit later. <laughs> this is uh, kind of a silly area. Yeah. Can you parry with weapons on this? Uh, yeah. Is there a bell on your head? There is a bell on my head. Yes. Oh god, I just souped up the dude. I have made a mistake. I have made a huge mistake. It's a Zot. Hey, a Zot. I basically just became a boss. Oh, 
Why are, why are my, wait, 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 why are my numbers gray against him? Am I, am I literally incapable of properly damaging this gentleman? Is that what I'm seeing? Ow. Oh, he's strong versus holy. Oh, good. Well, it's off. Sorry, bud. Doesn't look like I'm going to be avenging you today, man. Got him. All right, buddy. Well, hope, hope that helps, Azoth. <laughs> hope that helps. This guy's weird. I feel like we can do something special with him, but I'm not sure what. What happens if I soul suck him? Can we? I don't know. Hmm. He make the the big moth lady in there makes him invulnerable, which is strange. Anyway, we're gonna keep moving forward. We're a hundred percent gonna be coming back here later. This place is super interesting. Yeah, no, there's no parasite. The moth lady is attached, or the moth lady attaches to him. So it's like we have to kill the moth lady before he'll take damage. I think. I don't know. It's strange. I think that's how that works. Yeah, it's like shielding totems, but you'd think it would be the other way around and he'd be like further back or something. That's why it's a little bit strange. It's a strange order to have it in. Which makes me think it's... It, I think there's a creative way to use that situation. I'm not quite sure what it is. Off we go. There we go. Couldn't clear that stuff off. What happens if you try to soul pull him? Um, I tried. It, it, well, I, I don't think I had a charge for when I wanted to try. So we'd, we'd have to we'd have to do that again when we have charges and see what happens. We can try that in a minute. That's a, I mean, that's I think it's a good idea. I will say it's very strange that the exact same mobs have different hit points and stuff like you just saw in the last area. I'm not sure, I'm not sure how I feel about that. Like these mobs in the last area had about twice to three times the hit points as they have here. Maybe there's some kind of reasoning for that or... Maybe they were shielded somehow? What 
class we're going to do. We started as a Condemned, which is the lowest stat class. And uh, what we're doing now is we're kind of, I think we're going to go like a, a kind of a Paladin build. So we're doing Radiance and Strength and Vitality. We're going to see how we like that. And we might change it up. I, I don't know yet. Oh, another Umbral Eye. Ooh, what's this one do? Dodging at the right time applies Wither to the attacking enemy. Okay, that's absolutely gargantuan. Hmm. That is super interesting. That'd be amazing for bosses where we do a ton of dodging. Hmm. Got some anti tallow stuff. Ooh, geez. Definitely hoping to hit a lot more with that. Uh, is this, this feels like the right way. Yeah, here we go. Let me go ahead and play it safe. Oh, range guys. What does this do? mechanism seems to be stuck. Can I shoot them from this far? Well, I can shoot him for sure. That guy seems a little far. Yeah, I can't target him. He apparently has no problems targeting me. <laughs> Pride bound. Oh God. Oh no. Are these guys going to drop down? What are they doing? What's going on here? Hmm. I don't really want to go up there. At all. We, we only have one thing left. That area down there is our ski. I remember that area. We can try it though. This is gonna end poorly, but you know what? That's okay. That's okay. Oh, you know what I'm gonna do? Do we have enough? Yeah, let's let's umbro here. Here we go. Hell yeah. How's the game so far? Loving it, dude. Loving it. Uh, we need some more vitality. Let's do a hit of endurance. Gotta start getting our strength up.
Oh no! Jerk. Okay. Not close at all. Go the bonk machine, you know it. Bowl of revelations. Oh, I wonder if that's what we can give to the guy for the boss. Boss weapons! I wonder if it is. We're gonna have to try. You guys being tricky. Tricks the hobbitses. <laughs> oh, whoops. Go up. <laughs> I randomly say Trixie Hobbitses. And he goes, Yo, what's up, Co? Never change Twitch. Taking the pain, chat. Should have just taken the pain. That's two deaths so far total. Oh, for gravity. Mortis. You guys Two straight plants those things. Take it. <laughs> 